And a warning tonight about a possible puppy scam just two days before Christmas. A man posted an ad on Facebook saying he had poodles for sale. And when a customer asked about vaccination records, she was told that yes, they do have a shot record, but no record was ever produced. Denver 7's Lance Hernandez talked to the victim who reached out to Contact 7. Lance, she says she thought this might be a scam, but she purchased the puppy anyway. And she said she did that because she was worried about its health. She says it was lethargic and ended up being diagnosed with Giardia. She wonders if she had not taken the puppy, whether it would have survived. You're so precious. Jessica Lavoy loves her little Bichon Fries, but it's not what she originally wanted. She was looking for a poodle as a companion for Riddick. At a breeder, it's like $2,100 $2, to get one. Uh, yeah. So she went on Craigslist and found a post offering poodles for sale. She called and left a message, then got this text back saying there were three males available, $350 each. It just seemed kind of sketchy to me. And I mean, it's on Craigslist, and so automatically you're already kind of sketched out. And the pictures of the dogs, they didn't, they didn't look like a poodle. She asked about vaccinations and was told the dogs had a shot record. I said, do you have a picture of the mom? He sends me a picture, I said, that's a Bichon. Lavoy asked the owner to bring the dog to her apartment so she could see if it would get along with her poodle. Two men showed up with the puppy. He was a little lethargic and as soon as I picked him up, I could feel all of his bones. She also noticed a pus-filled sore on the puppy's ear. She was so concerned about its health, she decided to buy it. When she asked about the vaccination paperwork, she was told they forgot it but would get it to her the next day. They never did. I sent him a message saying, listen, I know you're not going to send me the records. You need to stop doing whatever it is you're doing. Um, and when I brought him to my vet, my vet said, you saved this dog's life. Lavoie says she can't help but wonder if the men who sold her the puppy are affiliated with a puppy mill. She posted a note regarding her experience on Craigslist and heard back from other prospective customers who say they were also in contact with the men. We reached out to the sellers, but have not heard back.